Well, as I said, we're going to all our agents, managers all around the world. Like, and on this occasion, now one of the most important things is flights. And here I have Kira. We've been operating with each other for over 30 years. She manages all our flight flights right around the world. Like, and uh, she has her own company, and we, we we're kind of a collaboration together. And it's Platinum Travel. So, Kira, can I just actually hand it over to you? as we talk about flights, because flights is the biggest headache that we have now in relation to dealing with travel. And you can explain why. So over to you and we try to do it as fast as possible. Thank you. No problem at all, Pat. Thanks very much. And thanks for having me along. And you and I have been doing flights for a very, very long time, but I don't think we've seen anything like the last two years. And as we come into this year, which we know is going to be going by the last couple of weeks and the last couple of months a, a crazy crazy busy year we need to make sure that we're doing everything right by all your guys that are heading away all over the world and um, it's it's crucial that we monitor things on them um, on a monthly basis on a weekly basis i know it's been frustrating that we've had to push things out a little bit later in the year we'd love to have got started as you were wanted to get started but you wanted to things to be safe so what we've done is we've been very careful and we've got people booked as we kind of go into the second quarter third quarter for the rest of the year we're watching the airlines we have very good airlines you've always worked with very good airlines pat because we know the ones we can rely on the ones that are going to look after our travelers the destinations that irish and worldwide adventures go to are not your stereotypical destinations they're not your portugal or your spain they are your africas and your asias and your south americas so it's even more important that we monitor what the rules are going into these countries, what are the rules coming out of these countries, what happens if when they get there, if they're insured, if they have to come home urgently, if they get sick. So that's what we're watching behind the scenes all the time. And it is frustrating when flights change and schedule changes, but you know that's what we're here for. And that's why you are so careful with every booking that your clients go on. Well, that's great. And can I ask like, what are the main kind of concerns now, like say from uh, PCR, injections like as we take it around the world just as, as in you know i know like we're talking to some people and this in in some countries pcr other time like i think the ancient test is only coming in in europe but africa and nepal and yeah. south america is, is a lot more strict it is. It's a lot stricter. And that's because of the countries that they are. You know, a lot of these countries are a lot poorer and they're a lot more careful now with people coming in because of the spread of disease. Well, the, the rule of thumb is probably go the strictest and cover yourself with that. And anything after that will be a bonus. So I would always assume worst case scenario, you have to be fully vaccinated, plus have a 72 hour PCR test ahead of arrival. Plus, you possibly have to have a PCR test when you arrive into the country. Now, that's probably as strict as it gets. And um, it will get stricter if you're not vaccinated. We also have new rules since early February in regards to uh, the, the length of your vaccination, how long you've been vaccinated, have you had a booster, are you recovering? So it's better to err on the side of being extremely cautious and presuming you're going to have a test. We will, of course, let all the people know on the groups and that are traveling in advance. But as they plan now for the summer ahead, it's better to be on the side of caution. You know, it is a personal decision to get vaccinated. Um, however, it, travel is easier if you're vaccinated. Aside from the COVID vaccinations, obviously, if there are certain countries that need extra ones like malaria, yellow fever, typhoid, all that, we will keep them posted on that. And obviously, they always check with their own GP about their own medical personal um, history, what they need. But I think erring on the side of caution about PCRs is probably the safest. And then it's only it can only be, you know, an antigen after that or maybe the testing will be removed. But always go the strictest and work your way back. And in some countries, what we're doing, just for everyone's information out here, we're actually tagging a day extra onto each place, especially if it's like if it's somewhere that's going to be kind of very panidicky. So we'll keep you informed on that as well. But uh, do talk to us. One of the other important things, as Kara well knows herself, is insurance, right? When you're booking and we now have a special insurance for travel agents like ourselves, that you know and I'll, I'll be talking about that by the way later and you can click on the links and you can go straight in so kira i think until our march meeting again that's everybody updated for now i just want to say thank you very much uh, it's always a great help and for everybody out there just to know in relation to flights getting in getting out and everything like that we have kira and platinum Right, okay, on a 24-7 standby. So if there's anything wrong, 
there is always something like you know that we can do and if you want to change flights let us know now it could be an extra cost if it's a case that the airlines actually are coming in you know more expensive to change the dates if you have specific dates that you want always ask yeah, so we always ask, Patrick, right? Always ask. That's what we're here for. I'm Pat Falvey and, 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 and the whole ethos of this is all tailor-made to suit you to make your dreams come true. So ask, 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 and we'll do anything we can. Absolutely. So on that note, like usually I was Jumbo in Africa. I was Namaste in Nepal and from here, Shlainta, Agus Goromahagut, you know, oh, Kiri, and Shaw, overlooking the beautiful lakes at Killarney, Kira. So thank you. Thank you, Pat. Thank you very much.